Hello everyone. In this video I would like to show you how I added this ambient lights to uh, my Volkswagen Yep. I actually added them on both uh, sides of the cars. Uh, it goes all around from here, the whole window, then here and to the back side of the car. And it's also on the other side, you can see them all the way to the back side of the, uh, of the car. And the good thing about these lights are that they can be controlled by the app. This is Android. I also test with uh, iPhone. So you can control the car, as you can see. You can control, turn them on and on, off. Now they are off, sorry. Now they are on. Also, you can control the brightness. Of the lights even though it can uh, listen to the music and also adapt the lights based on the music let's try this I'll just play the radio as you can see uh, they're using the microphone of the phone to adjust the light uh, of the rhythm of the music. So let's uh, get to the building and how I already mount this into the car. The lights are coming with the pack like this. In the pack you will find a cigarette lighter, connector, and then this is the, I think some DC converter and the Bluetooth. Uh, on the other side, you put the uh, 12 volt. On the other side, you put the uh, LEDs. This is the LED. This is one side of the LED. And on the other side, you put here an optic uh, cable, fiber cable. And you screw it with this bolt. I will show you in a minute how this is happening. So this is the pack. I'll put a link to the video description. There is also instructions how you can mount it. And they are in English. Okay, let's mount uh, the uh, LED first and then mount the mount optic cable. First, we have to remove this cap here which I will use these plastic tools. I will also put them into the video description. And to remove the cap here, you need just to put the tool here and go all around. This is where actually the, the fuses are located. Here, I already mounted one of the uh, LEDs, the laser LED, that is streaming the light all the way through uh, the car. So this is the laser. I'll just unscrew this bolt to show you. Use the laser. You have to unpeel a little, very small piece from the uh, optic tube that is carrying the light, and then. You connect it here, like that, and screw here the, this bolt. Very tight, very secured. You can use your hands, you can use a screwdriver. I'm screwing it with my hands. And then the cable, I just put it back here where my legs are, and then go all around to 12 volt battery. This is how I hide here the LED. I'll put it here, like that, just like that, and then I will secure this with the cap, like that. This 
this is how I placed and hide the LED behind this cup here. Now I already hide here the LED into the uh, side panel here and what I have to do is just to slide this into the rubber band like that. It goes all the way and this is how you can mount it. this like that and it's actually really very easy to mount it the way you want to do it so not now it's up to the cables this is the first cable that's coming uh, coming on from the uh, one side and this one here is the second cable. I will have to hide the cables also, but these are the cables that are coming from both sides, then they end with these connectors. So we need to plug them into the Bluetooth and like that, and the other one. There's only one way you can connect it, you cannot uh, put it the wrong way. And then it is time for the 12 volt battery to connect here with the plug. And I will place it into the cigarette lighter. Let me show you on the camera. There's a lot of cables here, a lot of mess, but I will clean this out. Now let's turn on the ignition. Okay, and let me press here the button and you can see here the lights, very nice blue color. Okay, that's it for this video, I hope you like it, if you like it, give me a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, see you soon.